Hi, I'm Kyle Harvey. And I'm Ward Nipper. Kyle and I are both real estate brokers with Baird & Warner in Chicago. Each Tuesday we tour broker open houses to get a first-hand look at what's available on the market. And we'd like to share what we see with you. So come with us as we tour Chicago real estate. Hi, it's Tuesday, April 16th, 2019, and we are on Tuesday Tour. Today we focus on properties in and around Streeterville. That's a north side neighborhood found um, at starting at Oak Street to the north, goes south to about um, to the Chicago River, and then east from Michigan Avenue to the lake. We started with the building with the building 777 North Michigan Avenue, which is right around the corner from our office at Chicago and Michigan. And we saw a, a really move-in condition apartment, uh, which was unit 3000, so the 30th floor. It had northeast views of Lake Michigan, the water tower, um, and really you wouldn't even need to paint. The apartment was really in, in move-in condition. Uh, that one is two, two bedrooms, two and a half bathrooms, and it's listed at 689000 Next, we saw a whole bunch of apartments at 111 East Chestnut Street. Um, that condo or that building is known as the Elysee Condos and it's got about 46 floors of apartments in a 57 story building. The, the other floors are uh, retail, uh, parking and um, some common areas. Well, there, yeah, they have a lot of apartments that have been reconfigured since it was built in 1971, but the building has generally studios, one bedrooms, two bedrooms. Um, and we saw mostly two bedrooms, I guess, mostly A units, didn't we? We saw a number of A units, but we did see one one bedroom, and yes. we saw um, one larger combined unit. Um, and as, as Ward said, a, a number of them have been combined. Um, a one bedroom has been combined with a two bedroom, or a one bedroom has been combined with a studio. So, and some have been combined, there have been three um, units combined together to make a much larger apartment. But we didn't see any of those. The ones that we did see yesterday ranged from uh, unit 23C, which is on the market for 619000 And the highest price point was $792,500 for unit 43A. I have one actually on the market for eight seventy five. dollars that but was we, also available. Right, but not. I don't know that we saw that one. Did we see it? Maybe we did. I think it was the one we started. In. Oh, okay. Sorry. No, it's all right. I stand correct. There's also, no, for heaven's sakes, there's also a brand new one that is a, one of those combined units that's on the market for $1.45 million, and the pictures are spectacular. So if you're in the market, that's a, that's a real beauty. What else do we see? We went to 180 East Pearson to the Water Tower residence. Um, after that and saw a unit that was a duplex unit which I guess I don't know how many duplexes there are the the agent told us that the unusual one aspect of this one is that it um, most of the duplexes have sort of a loft like sort of two-story uh, living room area so there's a almost a balcony on the second floor that looks down into the living room the uh, current owners of this one or maybe perhaps some previous owners uh, filled that in with a floor so it added an extra bedroom so there's actually um, essentially it's like having a townhouse basically in the sky you've got two two stories and the staircase yeah they really did an interesting thing apparently these staircases can be pretty functional just a straight shot up or a, a bend to it but these folks took out what had been there previously a spiral staircase which can be a little dangerous and instead it put in a very soft sweeping staircase. It's really quite elegant. Yeah, it's a very, very nice architectural feature. It was a very pretty, pretty aspect of the apartment. The apartment needs a little bit of updating. Love, it needs some love. It needs some love, and I'm sure that somebody will love it and, and make it beautiful. Yeah, but it had pretty south views, didn't yeah, it? Yeah, yeah it was, very, it nice was very, nice. very nice. And it's on offer for 1.395 million. Yeah. And then, Kyle, I was not able to join her, but Kyle went to a very nice uh, unit. Why don't you tell us about 840 North Lakeshore Drive? Well, this is um, listed privately right now. I don't think it's officially on the MLS, which is our um, open market. It is a really stunning 9,000 square foot um, full floor unit at the top of 840 North Lakeshore Drive. And 
among the things that make this special are the 12 foot ceilings, um, the wraparound terrace. So it, it's, it runs the entire um, unit. It's, there's one small spot where it doesn't exist because there are floor to ceiling windows that look out over um, the lake from that one spot, but it is incredible. And what's really also, I mean, besides the six bedrooms, the two laundry rooms, the um, incredible entertaining space, um, are, is the way they've organized the layout of this place to have some very private areas. So there's an area where you could have um, a mother-in-law live very happily with her own um, sort of living room and bedroom and bathroom, or um, you know, it could be a guest suite or whatever, but it, there's just room to do everything in this apartment. So it's being offered for the low, low price of $13.5 million. And I gotta say, it's worth it. <laughs> it's fantastic. So uh, if you're interested in seeing any of these, will you please reach out to Warden Me? And we're going to put some more information below the video. And if you look behind us, actually, we are talking about the neighborhood behind us. And so uh, 111 Chestnut, um, maybe I could put a little graphic thing on the video and we could show you where those buildings are. Yeah. You can't see Water Tower from here because it's blocked by 900 North Michigan. But the neighborhood in question is right behind us. And we hope you've enjoyed to do today's Tuesday tour. Bye. Bye. Thank you. If you're in the market for a new home and would like to see any of these properties, we'd be happy to make an appointment to show them to you. Or, if you have something else in mind, we'd be happy to show that to you as well. In the meantime, thank you for watching.